Suspect wanted for the stabbings of the Mo Museum of Modern Art has been arrested. Gary Cabano was apprehended by police early this morning down in Philadelphia. Police say he is a suspect in another crime that took place there yesterday. Fox 5's Briella Tomasetti is live in Midtown with all those details for us this morning. Briella, what can you tell us? What's going on here? Yeah, Dan, good morning. Pretty complicated situation. Uh, charges here on the attack at MoMA, they are still pending as Cabana still has to be extradited uh, back to New York. But in Philadelphia, he is being charged with arson after authorities say he set fire to the very hotel room on the fifth floor of the Best Western uh, in Center City that he had been staying at. I appreciate you guys. 60-year-old Gary Cabana, who was taken into custody in Philadelphia overnight, offered no explanation as to why he allegedly stabbed two employees at New York's Museum of Modern Art over the weekend. Instead, he told reporters to take a look at his social media profile, where he claims he was framed by museum employees. You might just stab everybody. Man, read my Instagram. Philadelphia police say Cabana was picked up at the Greyhound bus terminal after being spotted sleeping on a bench. They also believe he's connected to a motel arson unfolding earlier in the day. Around 6 p.m. Monday evening, 6th District Police and the Philadelphia Fire Department responded to a fire at the Best Western Hotel in the 1200 block of Vine Street. There was a fire in one of the hotel rooms on the fifth floor. Cabana had managed to evade the NYPD since Saturday afternoon. A search for him yesterday at the St. Francis of Assisi Church on West 31st Street turning up empty. This NYPD surveillance video showing the very moment Cabana allegedly hopped the ticket counter with a knife in hand, cornered and then stabbed two employees after they told him his membership had been revoked. The victims, a man and woman, both 24 years old, were taken to Bellevue Hospital in stable condition and all visitors were evacuated. He became uh, upset about not being allowed entrance and then jumped over the reception desk and proceeded to attack and stab two employees of the museum multiple times. Cabana's last known address is on West 43rd Street at a nonprofit residence for people who are homeless and suffering from mental illness. Police sources say the stabbings follow two other disturbing incidents that happened after he lost his job at the Nederlander Theater. Cabana allegedly sent threatening emails to a female union rep dating back to November 2021. He was slapped with a criminal harassment complaint for it. And in January, Cabana allegedly punched a manager in the face who escorted him out when he came to see a show. And that was our Briella Tomasetti reporting again. Gary Cabana, the suspect in that shocking attack at the MoMA Museum, has been arrested.